hey guys welcome back to my channel and uh, here's once again most important questions and we have the best short tricks for essential of communication now after watching this video most of the headings of the questions of the important questions you will be able to recall because of the short tricks and you will feel very easy in communication now the first question comes with the explain the factors which are responsible for the going importance of communication in an organization guys this is very important question the headings are here growth in size in multiple locations growth of trade unions growing importance of human relations public relations and technological advancement so these are the headings and i'll give you a short tricks guys before giving you a short tricks uh there if you want the notes of most important questions of ethics and communication so here's the link below this video in the description box you can go and you can find it go and purchase it because these are the very important questions. Now let's see the short tricks now. Technology helps to grow human and public relation and trade union in multiple locations. So you have to just revise this one line only and all the headings are ready. Technology helps to grow human and public relation and trade union in multiple locations. Let's see how it works now. Growth in size and multiple locations growth of trade unions, growing importance of human relations, public relations, technological advancements. So these are the headings and these are the short tricks and this is applied or short tricks in these headings. Let's see the next question now. Advantage of formal communication. So the headings of this is effective coverage, uh, effective then coverage, then filtering of information, fixing responsibility, and for the references so we have five headings let's see the short tricks now effective coverage of irr so i think irr you might have heard in a financial management subject in ceipcc so effective coverage of irr let's see the short tricks now uh, effective coverage okay so effective then coverage and then irr so i for information r for responsibility and again r for references so effective coverage filtering of information fixing responsibility and further references let's see the next question factors lead to grapevine communication so the factors lead to grapevine communication headings here lack of direction lack of self-confidence giving others a feeling of insecurity or isolation urge to talk to gain confidential information. Once again, we will read it. Lack of direction, uh, lack of self-confidence, giving others a feeling of insecurity or isolation, urge to talk to gain confidential information. Guys, this is really very difficult to understand. This is very difficult to memorize these whole headings. But after this short tricks, you will be able to memorize very easily. Let's see the short tricks. Direct talk is insecure. This, if you directly go with an unknown person and directly you will start talking so a little bit insecure so direct talk is insecure is is insecure so direct is a different heading talk is a different heading i for different heading s for different heading and insecure is a different heading let's see how it's work now direct talk is insecure okay so direct lack of direction direct talk urge to talk is I for information okay to gain confidential information is I for in, uh, information done then S for lack of self-confidence S for self-confidence is insecure so insecurity or isolation once again we will do lack of direction lack of self-confidence giving others a feeling of insecurity or isolation urge to talk to gain confidential information see the next question now type of grape wines so here is single chain chain cluster chain probability chain and gossip chain guys this is very important question question that's why i have just fitted the, this question actually uh, we don't have this uh, short trick of these four headings but this is very simple headings i think you can memorize it very easily but in case in future if i will be having any short tricks for this question so you will find that short trick below this video in the description box i'll just leave it for you Next question is various forms of non-verbal communication. So the forms are kinestic, paralanguage, adornment, proxemics, chronemics, haptics and silence. Guys, these all headings you have to uh, read it betterly. Means any of these headings they can ask you that what do you mean by kinestic? What do you mean by proxemics? What do you mean by silence? So nearly two marks they can ask you from this any of the headings. 
so this is a very important question just revise it from your book barriers to effective communication so what are the barriers actually in the book you will see a lot of barriers so here are some headings if the question is asking for four marks you can note down any of the four headings you can write four or five headings you can just note it and you can write it poor planning wrong channel offensive style lack of subject knowledge lack of communication skill information overloaded and poor retention so actually i have just shorted out very simple headings for you guys so any of these four heading as per your convenience four or five headings you can choose and you can write in your examination if the question comes next is checklist for preparation of business message so uh, this question has have come many times and uh, this is also a very important question let's see the headings of this first organize the message then outline the message then choose length of the message then formulate the message so there are four headings this question will come for four marks so organize the message outline the message choose length of the message and formulate the message let's see the short trick full f o o l this is the simplest short tricks ever now see how it works f o o l full so formulate the message f for formulate the message double o means o for organize the message then o for outline the message choose length of the message okay so now here is short tricks of chapter 1 of communication just wait for chapter number 2 within some times i'll upload short tricks for chapter number 2 and if you have not watched my ethics uh, short tricks you can go on my channel you can watch all the short tricks of ethics i have every short tricks of every chapter of every short tricks of every moments of ethics now you can go uh, on my channel you can visit my channel link is below this video of my channel you can go and watch it of all the short tricks of ethics now so and if you are not subscribed please subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon whenever i upload a new video you will get a notification from youtube thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day